Thank you very much, Klaus, and thank you very much to the organisers for inviting me. Yes, so, uh, so I'm going to be talking about building trust in the cloud and why, why we really need to move away from needing to trust our provider so completely. Um, so I'm going to talk about, do this talk in three parts. I'm going to start off talking about cloud security. I'm then going to move into the trust problem, because this to me is something that the, the consumers, but also the providers, need to understand much more deeply. And then we'll discuss a possible solution, particularly focusing towards the consumer. So, so, so cloud security. Well, so in 2008, the IDC did a, one of their big surveys, and they said, you know, well, security was a huge problem at that point. So that was 11 years ago. And then last year, RightScale did another uh, report looking at this, and surprise, surprise, security was also <coughs> still a problem. So from that point of view, 10 years have gone past, you know, some of the other things have moved down, so performance was the second highest problem in 2008, much lower problem now, management of multiple clouds, you know, the, the other problems, they change, they come, they go, but, you know, security still sits there, still at the top, still everyone's major, major issue. But, I would say, though, to be honest, it really isn't all that bad. Because actually the paradigm of cloud brings in a number of different changes to both how we use, configure, set up, participate in IT infrastructure as I'll discuss now. So if we look at the advantages, and the biggest advantage that I see is actually around distribution. It's actually about understanding that whereas if you have private infrastructure that you're managing and looking after all on your own, you actually need to ensure that you're looking after the high value, essentially in the same way you're looking after the low value, because it's all in one place, it's all in one data center you own, you're all needing to consider that. And that can be an issue. You know, we wouldn't, if we were looking at the crown jewels, we don't stick tons and tons of industrial diamonds in the town of London. No, we put the crown jewels there, and we put the industrial diamonds in the small building out on the Harwell Science Campus. But also, when we think about resi resilience and reliability, you know, different types of services need to be considered with different levels of...